G'day! My top 10 favourite snakes. Not really, because I love all snakes. So, I just thought I'd make up a fun list anyway. And this is based mostly on how awesome these snakes look. Um, me actually drawing these things. And the ones that I enjoy drawing the most. So let's kick off. Let's start off with number 10. The Carpet Python. The Carpet Python. It's a very common snake in Australia. Probably less common is its subspecies, the Diamond Python. But both these guys are awesome and fun to draw and paint. Coming in at number 9. The red-bellied black snake. It had to be on my top 10 list because it is a favourite snake of mine. They are just so gentle and so chilled out. Yes, it's a venomous snake, but it doesn't really want to hurt anybody. Coming in at number 8. I've often made the joke that babies play with rattles and real men play with taipans, but I have to admit I love the rattlesnakes. They make a cool noise and I love the way the tongue comes out and touches the top of the head and whips around really slowly. Beautiful, gorgeous creature. The gorgeous rattlesnakes. Oh. Coming in number seven is a personal favourite because I see these a lot and I'm often catching these guys and that is the Australian copperhead. The American copperhead, also very cool, also an awesome animal, but I'm putting number seven as the Australian copperhead. Number six is the king brown snake. Now, these guys are awesome because they get very big, and the one I'm drawing here now is pretty chilled out, doesn't really want to hurt me, just wants to do his own thing. Beautiful snake, the king brown snake. Number five, another non-venomous snake. It is the black-headed python. Now, it looks venomous, but it's not. It is this gorgeous snake. Glossy, shiny black, beautiful stripings, beautiful markings. A lovely snake. Coming in at number four is the brown snakes. The eastern brown snake, one of the most venomous snakes around, but I'm going with the western brown, because I love the stripy markings on this guy. Oh, and he's got a bit of spirit too. Beautiful snake. Coming in on the top three now, and number three I've put in the Death Adder. Sounds cool and awesome, but really it's a very chilled snake. If you don't step on this guy, it's not going to hurt you. And the colours. Beautiful markings, beautiful colour variations, a gorgeous snake. Coming in at number two, I'm going with the cottonmouth or the water moccasin. It is a beautiful snake, nice sort of beautiful markings on it, but when it opens its mouth, flash of white and amazing big fangs, it looks fearsome, but again, it doesn't want to hurt anybody, it wants to keep to itself. And now for a few honourable mentions.
Ah, you got me. Okay, number one. If you haven't seen the list already, you may have guessed my favourite snake would be the tiger snake. I have to say that because uh, my pet tiger snake, Lady Monster, would probably get angry if I didn't. But I love the tiger snake. It's extremely venomous, according to tests done on mice. Don't really know about humans, but it does have the second highest death toll in Australia, is the good old tiger snake. So it is a snake that deserves a lot of respect. It comes in some beautiful markings, but when you get to know the snake, and if you have a snake like this in captivity, it calms right down and becomes very chilled, very relaxed. A beautiful animal. So there you have my top 10 list. Put down in the comments what your top 10 favorite snakes is, as you like, or maybe if I've missed out a few, again in the comments, let us know what your favorite snakes are. Till next time, I'll see you later and check out some of these other videos.